on October 1st, Mayor Minor uh, and the city of Syracuse kicked 60 seniors out of the Ida Benderson Center, which is just across the street. Um, and it, these seniors were mostly poor, mostly people of color, um, and they were put out on the street because of budget cuts. Uh, so they got sold out, they got kicked out, while other financial institutions, rich people in this country, got bailed out and saved. Uh, so I want to know why that happens. And th that's the challenge for me when I get come down here, um, is why poor and working people and people of color, people that don't have much of a voice, uh, are being kicked out of their community center uh, when all of these other rich people are getting more and more, more than they need. Um, so that's what brings me down here today, what makes me stay here and stay within the movement. Um, and that, and it's this movement and the people that are here today that also give me hope. Uh, that it's not just me that thinks that this situation can be changed. That you standing here means that you've made a choice and you've made a decision that you can change this situation and that the next time seniors are kicked out of their community center, we're going to be here. Um, the next time that banks like Chase and Merrill Lynch are bailed out, we're going to be here to, to make sure that that doesn't happen. The next time money is wasted on war and death around the world instead of life in this country and elsewhere, we're going to be here to make sure that that happens. Um, so this is what influences me to stay here and asking all of you to join with me and to keep in this movement. Okay? So that's